Hey everybody, this is Derek with PreCentral.net, and today we're taking a look at a new app called Carbon. And we did check out Carbon a couple months ago uh, when it was in its beta form, and it's now coming out in the app catalog, so we wanted to give it another go. Carbon is a Twitter client, and what makes Carbon unique is its three-paned interface where you can swipe left and right between your home timeline, your mentions, and your messages. Now up at the top here, you might be seeing this menu where you can tap on it, get some profile information for yourself as well as view top tweets. You can hit your search, and you can also go and check out trends and what's you know trending on Twitter. Now Carbon does also thread your direct messages, so you can view it sort of on a Gmail style, one message right after another. There's no inbox or outbox or anything like that. Now, in addition to being able to compose tweets in this card, Carbon also lets you launch a new card in which to compose so you can keep your things all straight. Carbon also has plenty of other nice little features like this power scroll gesture where you can use two fingers to swipe up and down to get straight to the top or bottom of a page. And when you go ahead and tap on a tweet, you're given all sorts of options about how to reply, including your standard reply, a quote and reply, and the Twitter retweet as well as marking tweets as favorites. There are a lot of nice little visual features like this refresh spinner and the fact that your tweets are marked with little blue bars and tweets that are at replies to you in your timeline are marked with these yellow bars on the right side. Carbon does also include support for multiple accounts. You can either switch to a different account in this same card, or you can open up the accounts in multiple cards, which is very useful for keeping track of what's going on in multiple accounts. You will get notifications for each account separately, but as you can see, each account works exactly like the other accounts, you just have them in different cards, which is actually rather useful. This latest version also adds in support for just type quick actions. You, know, you fire up just type from card view here and you can start typing and you can either launch into a Twitter search inside Carbon or you can start composing a new tweet and have it pasted into a new tweet card in Carbon, which you can then post to Twitter and it will automatically dismiss itself. Now, in addition to all of this, Carbon has gained support for themes. There's currently only one other theme apart from this dark theme. It's called Oxide. It's a nice lighter theme uh, that may be a bit easier on the eyes for some. Now, there are dozens more features in Carbon that we just can't cover in this video. So go ahead and check out our review on PreCentral and get Carbon soon from the app catalog.